and it's specially made for young people and young guys with more methods and so on. Okay? <laughs> like more, more. Yeah, yeah, there's more, there's more. <laughs> Welcome to the education segment of Weiler here at the factory in Bavaria. Did you know there's over 100,000 machines of Weiler in the education aspect around the world? And on top of that, why? Why? Well, it's because we want the students coming into our industry to know what precision is like right away. Now, I have my friend Marcus here with me today. Hello. We're going to talk a little bit about education, and then we're going to actually interact with one of the machines so you can see how functional it is for you and your educational institute as well. So, Marcus, education is a big focus for Weiler. Why is that? Um, it's a big focus on Weiler because education is more than only a machine. Education is a learning concept. It's specially made for turning and milling machines and so on. And it's based on two bases. One of the bases is the digital twin on the machine and the second base is web-based training by a learning test on web platforms. Well, Marcus is the mastermind behind this, so you guys are lucky to have him with me today. Let's go take a look, Marcus, and actually do some interactive work for the audience. Now, this is kind of smart technology because you're adapting to what's modern and also going into a turning center. And if we're being fair with all the creativity and your machines and the big ones on the other side of the hall, <laughs> this would be considered a more simple model, but you've updated it in such a way to keep the education for today and modern for everyone who's watching and learning. Yes, that's right. Uh, the machine is a simple model of the machines, of turning machines. You can see here all the whole company. But it's special. The education on the machine, it's a training on the machine. It works with the digital twins of the machine, you see? I do, yes. It's very important for learning to operate the machine without any dangerous situations. And how does this actually work? You know, we're staring at it right now. I can physically touch this one, and we have a digital twin here. Is it real yes. simple? Just to, is it almost like a smartphone? Ye nearly, nearly a smartphone. Yes, okay. the handling is like a smartphone or a tablet. That's right. And so you can use it. You see the safety guard, and says the learning test how to use the safety guard. So we can go on the safety guard. Is there some declaration here? You can see it in German. Mm -hmm. So we have to put on the safety guard, so we know what is the safety guard. And the next step, we have to close the safety guard. We close it by the real machine, you see. And the digital twins follows, I think it's uh, one or two seconds. Yes, you see, it mm -hmm. moves. Wow, that's impressive. And, and it's just step by step. Can we keep yes, going through it's this? It's kind of exciting. It's, it's, like a, it's like a computer game. It's like a you video see. game. Yes. Oh, I was always pretty bad at video games, but I better be good at this video game. <laughs> So in the next step we have to start the machine, but if we start the real machine, the mm -hmm. real machine is very, very dangerous. If the work piece is going out of the machine and it hits you, it's very dangerous for you. So we can start the machine on the real machine, but only the digital twins starts to working. The real machine is stop. Ah, that's clever. So we've turned it on kind of physically on the machine, but the yes. main uh, turning area here is not spinning because of the danger. Oh. However, it is doing it here. Sorry, I have forgot to put on the machine. I have to, at first I have How to put on the main. How real is that? It really is engine. a digital twin of everything, yeah. isn't it? And so we have to can start the machine. And now you can see the spindle is start to working. You see? That's the green light. Yes, and the spindle. You see, it's turning. The real machine stands still. Wow, that's cool. And only thing I need so far is to learn German. <laughs> then we can take this step by step. So the process continues to repeat, I believe, as we go through the system to really allow students the interactive environment, maybe with the removal of danger, and then eventually yes. they can get into how the machine actually works, yes, yes. feel the vibration when they're cutting materials. And guys, this is really fascinating to me. I've never really seen such a thing in person. So thank you for showing me this, Marcus. Uh, so. I see it spinning you can on the screen. Open. Yep. Now and it's the stopped. It stops, and the real machine doesn't work anytime. It's you very see? clever. And so you can go to the next step. So you have to use the safety guard, the safety stops, or the safety guard here. But it's only a small part of the education. Education is very more. You can see we have basics on the machine, how to use the machine, safety guards, the how to, how to operate the tail stock, how to operate the tools, how to clamp uh, work pieces on the machine, and so on. I mean, completely interactive. 
So as much as I'd love to spend a lot more time, I want to leave some awe and uh, questions for the audience as well to come in or go into a facility and play with the Weiler machines. Otherwise, this video is going to get real long, but we're <laughs> going to cut this thing off and I'm going to train with you. Is there any last minute messages you would like to offer to anyone out there who's considering working with the Weiler machine as a piece of their educational platform? Um, one important of the working with the Weiler machines in the platform is you can use the machine with only safety conditions. That's very important. And the second base is also the learning test on the web-based platform we have. Also the web-based training you can use before you go at first time to the machine for preparation. And you can use it after working on the machine for following up. Absolutely perfect, I Marcus. Okay. I believe that. You've done a wonderful job for the audience watching. Even I can't break this, I don't think. So thank you all for watching. I hope you've learned something today. Take a look at Weiler. Give them a Google. Give them a shout and see if they can support you and your company as well. Thank you all for watching. We'll see you again soon.